What's up guys, it's Risky here. We're back out here on Fishing Planet today. We're going to be doing some more fishing here on the Lone Star Lake since it's so damn expensive to actually travel to the other places and it's just not worth it at the moment. I'm too low a level, I don't have enough money and I actually did purchase the unlimited advanced license so we can come out here and catch and keep whatever the hell we want so we don't have to worry about that anymore. I hope you guys did enjoy the last episode of Fishing Planet. That was a lot of fun. And this is kind of like my placeholder game for Call of the Wild right now. It's another outdoor game that's really realistic and, like, you know, it's, it's somewhat enjoyable. It's kind of confusing and frustrating, but it's it's cool, and I think it's just going to be a placeholder. This is probably the last video before Trophy Lodges come out, and which is Thursday. So Trophy Lodges come out on Thursday. I think I'm going to upload a video on Thursday, it'll probably come out a little bit later since I have crappy internet, and I'll probably get on first thing Thursday morning, and, you know, whenever the DLC comes out, go out there, make a video, edit it up, and it'll probably come out like 3 or 4 on Thursday, I don't know, whenever in the afternoon, whenever I get it up, but, yeah, stay tuned for that. Trophy Lodges will be my main focus for the next couple of weeks or whatever, just trying to fill one up. I have a bunch of plans and awesome video ideas for the Trophy Lodges. Oh. Come on, buddy. You know you want to snag it. Come on. I have a lot of things planned for the Trophy Lodges. I'm very, very excited for those. It's like two more two more days, I think, by the time this video is up. I think it's going up on a Tuesday or something, right? What's, what's today? I don't even know. It's, it's going to be very soon, like two or three more days. So this is probably going to go up on Tuesday. Probably won't be a video Wednesday. And then we'll have one on Thursday. And I also wanted to say something. Do you guys play on PC? Like, wh what kind of gaming PC do you got? Do you play PC or are you in console? I think we're hung up in the weeds right now. I think it is a Lembrim. It's definitely a Lembrim. Oh, we caught a weed. <laughs> we caught ourselves a monster weed. But what I was saying, do you guys have a gaming PC? If so, what kind, what brand, or is it custom built, and what are your specs? Because I've been really looking into gaming PCs lately and a lot of you know know that I've been saying it for like the past couple months which hopefully within the next month and a half two months I'm gonna have my own gaming PC I've been saving up my money and I'm, I almost have enough for the one I want oh we got something that's a fish that's a bass that's gotta be look at him jumping that is definitely a bass look at this little jumper come on buddy oh it is a bass oh a nice one. Oh, never mind he looks so big he just looks giant and you catch like a one and a half pounder, and they're like, they don't even look this big. Nice though, $77. We'll go ahead and keep him. The specs of the computer that I've been looking at, it's just $700 on, uh, <laughs> it's $700 on Amazon. This is like the best bang for your buck, in my opinion, unless you build one, which I really don't feel like building one. Um, I just want to get one pre-built. Maybe in the future, I can build one. Like I'm confident enough to build one. Like I, I think I could do it. Oh, come on, buddy. We're getting some nibbles. This is a pretty good time of day. We had some kind of tension on the line there. Um, but this one, it's 700 bucks on Amazon. It has an Intel Core i5-3570. Now, I did find one that was $750, and it had the Intel Core i5-7400, which is a little bit better than this one. But this one has 16 gigs of RAM, a 2 terabyte hard drive, Windows 10 and stuff like that already installed, NVIDIA. GTX 1060, three gigabyte one, and you know it has built-in Wi-Fi and it's made and it looks a lot better. It has like six RGB fans in it with awesome lighting, um, and it just it's cosmetically better than the other one. The other one was just a black case. It was called the HP Pavilion Power, but this one, the only thing worse on it is the processor, which is upgradable. The other one that I was looking at is not upgradable. This one is. Um, but yeah, let me know if that's a pretty decent PC. I've been looking at reviews about it all day, videos on it, just everything. I, I really want to make sure I'm spending my money in the right place, and I'm not just going to regret buying it and spending $700 that I've been saving up for a long time and, you know, just be disappointed. But it, it there's so many positive reviews. There's a couple negative ones that's like, oh, it could have a better processor, which, yeah, it could, but I can always upgrade that in the future. Let me know if you guys have a gaming PC, and if you do, what are your specs? I would like to know, and let me know kind of what kind of games you guys can handle and what kind of settings and stuff, because I'm pretty interested in that stuff right now. But let's get out here and do some fishing. I'm going to stop rambling on.
Oh, some. Oh, we got some. Okay, so that's what you got to do. You know, I fish in real life, obviously. I mean, I I used to fish. I don't really do it that much anymore. I haven't fished in a real long time. But whenever you feel your stuff nibbling, you just got to let it sit. I forgot, man. It's been a long time since I fished in real life. Probably about a year or so. Um, yeah, it's been a while. You know, I, I know about fishing and stuff. I know I know what to do. I know how to fish. <laughs> I ain't no city boy. But, yeah, I, I just forgot. And I learned that again from a video game, so that was kind of helpful. But we got ourselves a little bit of a bluegill. That was a point forty four pound bluegill. Not bad. Oh, big on, big old fish on. That was a pretty good strike from that fish, just out of nowhere. That's so freaking satisfying. If you ever had that feeling in real life, you know what I'm talking about. That is awesome. When you're just reeling along, and then you just snag one up. Look at this monster. Man, they look so much bigger than they actually are. One pound, 13. 1.13 pounds. One point. Yeah, okay, yeah, one pound. <laughs> uh, 78 bucks from him. He's 12 inches. And 78 bucks, like I said. Not bad. Spotted bass. Just what I wanted to catch. That was first cast with this new uh, bait as well. Oh, yep. First cast. First freaking cast. We got ourselves one. Yep, I was literally just reeling. And I think this is a bluegill. Yep, bluegill. 1.4 pounds. I think that's a little bit smaller than the first one we caught. We'll go ahead and keep them because that's money in my pocket and I need that. I'm actually going to swap up locations from this dock. I'm actually going to head like on the other side of the shore over there. Kind of see a little sandbar, or not sandbar, but a little beach type thing uh, with the sand. We're going to run over here. I haven't never fished over on this side. Let's see if we can get lucky. I think like right around here is a pretty good spot. And you know what? This looks like a pretty good spot for like a bass jig. So I'm going to swap back if I can. If it'll let me. Is it going to let me? Okay, it's not going to let me. Well, never mind. We're just going to cast this out here and see what happens. Oh, fish on last minute. I think it's a bluegill. Looks like one. Uh, yes, sir. this is our biggest one so far. It's a .51 pounder. And I think it's actually for less money. Maybe because he's uh, probably smaller in inches. I need to start looking at that, too. We're almost to level 10. So we're going to keep on fishing until we're level 10. We might call it a day there. I, like I said, I wanted to get my fish hut to 10 pounds, but we're going to be here all day if I try and do that. So we're only at 3 pounds. I've been here for like 20 minutes already. And uh, you can see where we are. Let's see if I can swap my bait. Oh, there we go. That's what I wanted to do. I want to try out this mini bass jig, like in these pad areas, like just along the side of the pads here. Maybe there are any bass and stuff hiding in there. So I want to catch bass. If anything, okay, what the hell? That's <laughs> that's like me casting in real life. No, I'm kidding. I can cast. Sometimes I always forget to little to flip the little bail thing in Bob, and you know I just sling it and it just doesn't go anywhere. I've done that a bunch, like out in public fishing, and it's so embarrassing. People like look at you and they'll laugh under the breath. Oh, I hate that feeling. You guys ever did that? I've done it a couple times. Well, that fish just jumped right there. Oh, got a fish. We got ourselves a fishy. I think it's a bleh bass. A bleh bass. <laughs> it is a bass. 1.1 pounder, 12 inches. Are we $88? Did we just level up? I think we leveled up. Did we? Hold on, let me go back to the menu here. Oh, I did, I think. Let's catch a certain... Oh, we got like a coin thing. I think we're like... like you can kind of see the bar there. No, I don't want to leave. Go fishing. Alright, I think I need one more fish. From the little... XP bar, it looks like I'm like right there. I'm like a pubic hair away from, you know, leveling up. So let's try and catch one more fishy fishy, and that's probably going to be it for today. Uh, oh, fish on, baby. I was just singing a song. You probably didn't hear it because I edited it out, hopefully, if I remember. <laughs> that was embarrassing. Um, we got a fish. I don't know what it is. I hope it's a bass. I hope it's a bass because bass are good money. Don't tell me. Oh, my game. I thought it just crashed. Oh, it's a white crappie. Cool. All right, we did level up. 28 bucks. Sweet. We filled our fish up. Fish hut with five. Oh, we got some more items. <gasps> Let's go, dude. I've been wanting these worms. What else did I get? Maggots. Yum. Pear-shaped floats. Some nano spoons. I got shrimp, crawfish, poppers. What? I got a clothes feeder. 
Got some new reels and new hooks. Bait caster, a combo back. What, dude? Some new leaders and stuff. Oh, no, I don't think those... Yeah, those, are, those look like leaders. And some mono leader. What? And let's claim our reward. We got 60 XP today. $314. Now we're going to travel back. We're in the airplane right now. We did get ourselves some spinner baits, which we do have unlocked now, which we're going to go ahead and purchase because spinner baits are badass. Uh, but I'm going to do that off recording. I'm going to just end this real quick, give you guys an outro, and then uh, I might record another one because this is actually really fun right now, and I kind of want to do that. But anyways, thank you so much for watching the video. Hopefully in the next video after this one will be the Trophy Lodge. You know, first video of the Trophy Lodge is coming out on the 100 Call of the Wild. Stay tuned for that. If you did enjoy this video and want to see more fishing plan and have any any tips for me or anything like that, um, be sure to let me know those in the comment section down below. I'd appreciate it a lot. And also hit that like button, subscribe if you have not already. And I'll see you all in the next one. Later.